Hey guys, it's Burgas here and today I'm going to show you the most crazy strategy I have ever seen in Drown Here 7 Gods. And as a content creator, I, I saw a lot of stuff and I try a lot of stuff just to provide better content for you guys. But this thing here just grabbed my attention and I was like, I, I have to share this. I have to share this. Now, the thing I'm going to talk about is about this team here. Now, here you can just switch the heroes. <laughs> I mean, it's obvious. But the main point here is the timing. I have never seen a timing like this, especially in the Goblin Lair. You try to finish the Goblin Lair as fast as you can. And as you can see, this guy is going to finish Goblin Lair 3 in 50 seconds in advance. And this is the heroes. There, there is even one level 76 hero here. <laughs> Imagine that. So I'm going to directly go <clears throat> and show you because yeah, after this, we're going to, of course, check the gear. Now here, the attack for is 18%. This is basically coming from this guy here. Uh, what was his name? I got, I, I forgot his name. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, just, just to be more clear with, with the names. Since, yeah, all the three stars is this guy here, which is Ellie. Oh my god, this sounds like a female name, but anyway, this Ellie, he's having this aura, 80% in all battles. So, <laughs> here comes the here comes the strategy and the, the perfect timing. I have never thinking about this. Uh, so, yeah, let's go. So, here they start fighting. As you can see, uh, nothing crazy is happening. Right now, some heroes are ready to fire up. Now, Vorish, Karl is all the heroes with some debuffs hitting the whole map. And the secret is basically destroying everything. This is two waves, kill it in same time. Here we have one gnome that is little far away, but again, Vorish and Karl is going to hit the whole map. So here comes, we're waiting for a second, and boom! And here comes the secret destroying basically everything. And here, to not lose time, use this level 76 hero. That is basically there for the aura, but still you can actually get other hero to support that. But anyway, again, it's just a waiting game. It's so fast, it's so easy. When I saw that, I was like, what is going on? As you can see, Sigrid is basically doing the work here. And boy, oh boy, I want to see the damage, by the way. I didn't actually focus on the damage. 54% from Sigrid, 23 from Vorish, and 16 from Karl. The rest of these two heroes basically don't do nothing. This one is for the tank, just to keep uh, mobs uh, stuck it on one place. This one is for the aura, Ellie is for the aura. Karl and Vorish is the main heroes here. Uh, is the heroes also, but the main hero is actually Sigrid, and that was crazy. I mean, first time when I saw that, I was like, What is going on here? So, let's check it out. The gear I'm, I'm like 100% sure that this is a legendary gear. I mean, there is no chance to be, but still, I think maybe only Sigrid, yeah, it's a legendary gear. Critical damage 131 is basically. 100% critical rate. This is so precise here. <laughs> uh, I, I guess the rest of the heroes is also going to be with uh, a legendary gear. But uh, still, just the timing, the way these things was done and executed, I really like it. It was insane. Since when you start hitting um, the first mobs, the first wave, you actually take out some of the damage for like two three mobs at the beginning before the next wave is coming and when the next wave is coming Vorish fire up and kill maybe one or two of the first two uh first two creatures and after this calf is firing up and in same time secret so secret basically is going to kill like five at this point after Vorish and Karl uh, hit and they're going to be left like maybe two, three, maybe four. But still, Sigrid is going to regen the energy and it's going to fire up again and it's going to destroy them. That was a crazy fight. 
Um, but yeah, I mean, I understand people, they're going to say, oh my god, this is a legendary gear, why you show us a legendary gear, heroes? But I think this can be done even with epic gear. And I'm definitely going to try this strategy. Now, I don't have this one, but I have Frurbat that can also support in some way uh, the debuffs since you need debuffs on the creatures so Sigrid can hit everybody. But yeah, this is huge strategy around Sigrid. And yeah, I really am I'm curious about your opinion, guys. What do you think? Do you like this strategy? Do you think it's something new or maybe it's something that you already know? I don't know. It's new for me and yeah, it is crazy. So yeah, I guess this will be for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do, hit one like, subscribe and see you in the next one.